Brought to you by the Modern Nose Clinic. Nasal irrigation, how it's done. Okay, so my name is Doug Scarada at the Modern Nose Clinic, and we typically use this product here, and I thought it might be useful for those of you who might have a procedure with us, or those of you who aren't even our patients, to understand how I recommend using it. It might, might, might be of interest. So of all the pictures on this box, the only picture I find of any use is this one. And this is a picture of a lady irrigating her nose. There's three things about this picture we find to be useful. One is that her head should be parallel with the countertop, so she's looking straight down at the drain in the sink. Number two, the bottle should be directed directly up, going perpendicular to the orientation of your head. So it will enter one nostril and the gravity will take it down the other nostril. And three, you need to be exhaling out your mouth while you're squirting in through your nose. I find it to be helpful to watch me do a demonstration, which will be, if not helpful, at least entertaining. Here you go, thank you very much. So this is a bottle, so suspend your disbelief. Unscrew the lid, one packet of powder, fill it up with water that you consider to be safe, shake it up, and you might say, Dr. Scarada, doesn't it go like this while I look at the mirror? I mean, my nose goes like that. And I would say, no, that's completely wrong. You wanna be looking straight down at the drain, you want this to be going straight out so it's perpendicular. You want to be breathing out your mouth while you squirt in through your nose, like this. Three or four squirts, and you'll be done the entire bottle. Put another packet of powder in, fill it up with water, safe water, shake it up, do the other side, same thing. Do an entire bottle on the right, do an entire bottle on the left in the morning, do an entire bottle on the right, do an entire bottle on the left in the evening. If you'd like, you can do it multiple times a day. Think of it like washing your hands for your nose. During those first two weeks after surgery, it's really important to keep your nose moist so you can maximize the healing process. Thank you from the Modern Nose Clinic, it's Doug Scarada. Thank you. We know your nose.